Shit! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, well that's what I get. Alright, welcome back everybody to part two of our adventure here in the Kakari Wilds. Uh, just trying to figure out. There we go. I was like, how the hell do I get out of here? Okay. So the next part that we need to do is that we already collected the darkspawn, uh, the vials, for the ritual that we need. But now we got to go collect, like, the treaties. So uh, I think you can see... Well, all right. So you see all the fillers up there. It looks like there's kind of like a fence. There's We're going to get am. Bushed, I want to say probably about like four, maybe four or five dark spawn. But there's like one of them, I think it's a herlock. It's a one that carries like a, I think he carries a battle axe. But, uh, oh, look, oh. Dark spawn. there it is. What a surprise! Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Are we just gonna keep shooting at each other until one of us dies? If we're playing chicken? Hmm. Okay. That was ridiculous. <laughs> I can't believe that that actually worked. But, alright, so I ended up just taking out one of them. Uh, one of the archers. But, so, tell you what. Um, alright, there's another one. Yep. Are you? Oh, you're another archer, too. Oh, alright. Maybe that pulled the rest of them. Uh, yep. Alright. So it looks like they're all going to go off. Good. Alright, time to move. There is an oh shoot there are two more archers okay hmm. let's see if we can quickly take this guy out then there go 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 um, there there's the guy that I was talking about but he doesn't have the axe uh he's it looks like he's got two swords or two daggers so I'm gonna try taking out that. Miss, no, don't miss. There. Oh, yeah. I already used dirty fighting. Okay, I should use then dual weapon sweep right here. Hmm. Oh man, he hasn't been like hurt at all. So, it's not bad. Let's force this guy. Yep. And then by the time, I'm hoping that dirty fighting will come up. Yep. Stun him again. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so that went much easier. I think just by picking off that first archer was ridiculous. <laughs> uh, Alright, cool. So we got a dagger. I will definitely take that. Mm, I don't think there was anything else here. Yeah, nothing else. Okay. Alright, so let's loot the remaining bodies. Head on up. And go get them treaties. Cool. Finally got a health potion. All right, and well, well, what have we here? Are you a vulture, I wonder? 
A scavenger poking amidst a corpse whose bones were long since cleaned? Or merely an intruder? Come into these dark spawn filled wilds of mine in search of easy prey. What say you, hmm? Scavenger or intruder? Tis a tower no longer. The wilds have obviously claimed this desiccated corpse. I have watched your progress for some time. Where do they go, I wondered? Why are they here? And now you disturb ashes none have touched for so long. Why is that? Don't answer her. She looks chastened, and that means others may be nearby. Oh, you fear barbarians will swoop down upon you. Yes, swooping is bad. She's a witch of the wild, she is. She'll turn us into toads. Witch of the wilds. Such idle fancies, those legends. Have you no minds of your own? You there, handsome lad. Tell me your name and I shall tell you mine. Let us be civilized. And you may call me Morrigan, if you wish. Shall I guess your purpose? You sought something in that chest? Something that is here no longer? Here no longer? You stole them, didn't you? You're some kind of sneaky witch thief. How very eloquent. How does one steal from dead men? Quite easily, it seems. Those documents are Grey Warden property, and I suggest you return them. I will not, for it was not I who removed them. Invoke a name that means nothing here any longer if you wish. I am not threatened. Twas my mother, in fact. Hmm. There is a sensible request. <laughs> I like you. I'd be careful. First it's, I like you. But then zap, frog time. She'll put us all in the pot, she will. Just you watch. If the pot's warmer than this forest, it'd be a nice change. Follow me then, if it pleases you. Mom, um, we have company Mother. for dinner. Before you four grey wardens who... I see them, girl. Hmm. Much as I expected. Are we supposed to believe you were expecting us? You are required to do nothing, least of all believe. Shut one's eyes tight or open one's arms wide. Either way, one's a fool. She's a witch, I tell you. We shouldn't be talking to her. Quiet, Dara. If she's really a witch, do you want to make her mad? There is a smart lad. Sadly irrelevant to the larger scheme of things, but it is not I who decides. Believe what you will. And what of you? Do you possess a different viewpoint? Or do you believe as the others do? A statement that possesses more wisdom than it implies. Be always aware. Or is it oblivious? I can never remember. So much about you is uncertain, and yet I believe. Do I? Why, it seems I do. So this is a dreaded witch of the wild. Witch of the wild, huh? Morrigan must have told you that. She fancies such tales, though she would never admit it. Oh, how she dances under the moon. <laughs> did not come to listen to your wild tales, mother. True, they came for their treaties, yes? And before you begin barking, your precious seal wore off long ago. I have protected these. You... Oh, you protected them. And why not? Take them to your Grey Wardens and tell them this Blight's threat is greater than they realize. Such manners. Always in the last place you look. Like stockings. Oh, do not mind me. <laughs> you have what you came for. Time for you to go, then. Do not be ridiculous, girl. These are your guests. Oh, very well. I will show you out of the woods. Follow me. All right, cool. So we got the treaties. Oh, excuse me. 
met the Witch of the Wilds um, and Morgan, so we don't quite know a whole lot about them, but now camp nighttime. Let's see. Uh, I suspect you are uh, one of the new Grey Wardens. Will you accept the Maker's blessing? Uh, no. Then be gone, even. Let the Grey Wardens <laughs> accept the likes of you is forever their greatest weakness. <laughs> wow. All right. <laughs> that was pretty mean. All right. So now it's nighttime, though. There's no guard around the chest for the mages. So I'm gonna take that. All right. Uh, yeah. So that was all just from the key that we took from the uh, the prisoner. I don't think. Yeah, there's nothing else back here. Okay. All right. Let's just go and tell you what. We'll give the flower that we picked up first to the kennel master. Greetings. Are you one of the Grey Wardens that went into the wilds? Did you happen to see any white flowers? I don't know for sure that the flower will aid my poor hounds, but it's worth trying. I have, uh, let's see, 20 silver to offer as a reward for it. Mm. Thank you right. for your assistance, sure. then. Perhaps we won't lose as many hounds as I'd feared. I mean, hey, man, I'm a rogue, okay? I'm not going to do things for free. Not anymore. So you returned from the wilds. Have you been successful? Good. I've had the Circle Mages preparing. With the blood you've retrieved, we can begin the joining immediately. Excellent. You will need that courage to face what comes next. Courage? How much danger are we in? I will not lie. We Grey Wardens pay a heavy price to become what we are. Fate may decree that you pay your price now rather than later. I agree. Let's have it done. Then let us begin. Alistair, take them to the old temple. One of us. One the more I of hear us. About this joining, the less I like it. Are you blubbering again? Why all these damn tests? Have I not earned my place? Maybe it's tradition. Maybe they're just trying to annoy you. Ah, oh, Jesus, stop yammering. You're giving me a headache. I only know that my wife is in Hyover with a child on the way. If they had warned me, I... it just doesn't seem fair. Would you have come if they'd warned you? Maybe that's why they don't. The Wardens do what they must, right? Including sacrificing us? I'd sacrifice a lot more if I knew it would end the Blight. Yeah, make a good point. You saw those Darkspawns tonight. Wouldn't you die to protect your pretty wife from them? I am... Maybe you'll die. Maybe we'll all die. If nobody stops the Darkspawn, we'll die for sure. I've just never faced a foe I could not engage with my blade. At last, we come to the joining. The Grey Wardens were founded during the First Blight, when humanity stood on the verge of annihilation. So it was that the first Grey Wardens drank of Darkspawn blood and mastered their taint. We're going to drink the blood of those... those creatures? As the first Grey Wardens did before us, as we did before you. This is the source of our power and our victory. Those who survive the joining become immune to the taint. We can sense it in the Darkspawn and use it to slay the Archdemon. We speak only a few words prior to the joining, but these words have been said since the first. Alistair, if you would. Join us, brothers and sisters. Join us in the shadows where we stand vigilant. Join us as we carry the duty that cannot be forsworn. And should you perish, know that your sacrifice will not be forgotten. And that one day, we shall join you. Davith, step forward.
sorry it happened. Step forward, Jory. But I have a wife, a child. Had I known... There is no turning back. No. You ask too much. Th there is no glory in this. I am sorry. But See, I'll never get this. not yet complete. Like, I'll never get that. Like, why couldn't he just walk you away? Are called upon to submit yourself to the taint for the greater good. From this moment forth, you are a gray warden. Two more deaths. In my joining, only one of us died, but it was horrible. I'm glad at least one of you made it through. How do you feel? I can't believe you killed Jory. Jory was warned that there was no turning back, as were you all. When he went for his blade, however, he left me no choice. Yeah, but he, he was me backing no up his with life. his blade. It's not like he was approaching. Life demands sacrifices from us all. Thankfully, you stand here as proof. They are like, not yeah, all made in vain. Did you have dreams? I had terrible dreams after my joining. Such dreams come when you begin to sense the dark spawn, as we all do. That and many other things can be explained in the months to come. Before I forget, there is one last part to your joining. We take some of that blood and put it in a pendant. Something to remind us of those who didn't make it this far. Take some time. When you're ready, I'd like you to accompany me to a meeting with the king. The meeting is to the west, down the stairs. Please attend as soon as you're able. Hmm. All right, so we are a full-fledged Grey Warden. As well as, we got the Warden's Oath. <laughs> I mean, obviously, it's significantly uh, worse than what I have, but, you know, this at least, your character, I don't know, I might keep this as a keepsake, but it's only been, uh, you can only, only the main character can wear this. Um, but I also, I did pick up that dagger. Yeah. Ooh, plus four to attack, too. That's awesome. Mm. All right. So, let's quick level up. Uh... Yeah, I think I'm still just going to do that. I'm just going to try to get to like 30 decks. Yeah, probably about 30 decks, and then I'll stop. And then I'm going to pump a crap ton of points into cunning from there. Uh, that one I should definitely get. Granting wider flanking angle, you know, that makes backstabs easier. That is... Oh, and momentum. Yes. Okay. All right. So, you know, with Ghost. What I'm thinking is that uh, it's just going to almost be like a generic kind of backstab build for right now. Stunning, yeah, definitely. Okay, uh, but anyway, like I was saying, um, so I'm gonna try to make it like a generic backstab build right now. Especially if I put on like momentum, it should increase my attack speed. 
the combat f combat movement or whatever I picked up beforehand, so it increases the flanking angle. So hopefully I can just quickly backstab as, as much as possible. Uh, I just don't know, because I, I think there's a significant difference like in the attack speed between like a, a long sword and a dagger. So I may want to just go ahead and find another dagger instead. I will stand by the Grey Wardens in this assault. You risk too much, Kaelin. The Darkspawn Horde is too dangerous for you to be playing hero on the front lines. If that's the case, perhaps we should wait for the Orlesian forces to join us after all. I must repeat my protest to your fool notion that we need the Orlesians to defend ourselves. It is not a fool notion. Our arguments with the Orlesians are a thing of the past, and you will remember who is king. How fortunate Marek did not live to see his son ready to hand Ferelden over to those who enslaved us for a century. Then our current forces will have to suffice, won't they? Duncan, are your men ready for battle? They are, your majesty. And this is the young lord from High Ever I met earlier. I understand congratulations are in order. Every Grey Warden is needed now. You should be honored to join their ranks. Your fascination with glory and legends will be your undoing, Kaelin. We must attend to reality. Fine. Speak your strategy. The Grey Wardens and I draw the Darkspawn into charging our lines, and then? You will alert the tower to light the beacon, signaling my men to charge from To cover. flank the Darkspawn, I remember. This is the Tower of Ishal in the ruins, yes? Well, who shall light this beacon? I have a few men stationed there. It's not a dangerous task, but it is vital. Then we should send our best. Send Alistair and the new Grey Warden to make sure it's done. <laughs> I refuse to be sent on an errand. All you right. rely on these Grey Wardens <laughs> too much. Is that truly wise? Enough of your conspiracy theories, Loghain. Grey Wardens battle the Blight no matter where they're from. Your Majesty, you should consider the possibility of the Archdemon appearing. There have been no signs of any dragons in the wilds. Isn't that what your men are here for, Duncan? I... Yes, Your Majesty. Your Majesty, the tower and its beacon are unnecessary. The we will of not Major... trust any lives to your spells, mage. Save them for the Darkspawn. Enough! This plan will suffice. The Grey Wardens will light the beacon. Thank you, Loghain. I cannot wait for that glorious moment. The Grey Wardens battle beside the King of Ferelden to stem the tide of evil. Yes, Kaelin. Glorious moment for us all. You heard the plan. You and Alistair will go to the Tower of Ishal and ensure the beacon is lit. What? I won't be in the battle. This is by the King's personal request, Alistair. If the beacon is not lit, Terran Loghain's men won't know when to charge. So he needs two Grey Wardens standing up there holding the torch just in case, right? That is not your choice. If King Kaelin wishes Grey Wardens to ensure the beacon is lit, then Grey Wardens will be there. We must do whatever it takes to destroy the Darkspawn, exciting or no. I get it, I get it. Just so you know, if the King ever asks me to put on a dress and dance the Remigold, I'm drawing the line. Darkspawn or no. Way to take a stand, Alistair. I have my dignity. Well, some. Hmm. <laughs> the tower is on the other side of the gorge from the king's camp, the way we came when we arrived. You'll need to cross the gorge and head through the gate and up to the tower entrance. From the top, you'll overlook the entire valley. All right. We will signal you when the time is right. Alistair will know what to look for. How very convenient. You only tell Alistair everything. Can we join afterwards? Stay with the Terran's men and guard the tower. If you are needed, we will send word. Ugh. Okay. Then I must join the others. From here, you two are on your own. Remember, you are both Grey Wardens. I expect you to be worthy of that title. Duncan. May the Maker watch over you. May he watch over us all. All right, Alistair is back in the party. Let's quick level him up.
think it's a, I think I want to do Dex. Yeah. Okay. I definitely think I want to do Dex. That's why. Okay. Shield Mastery. Okay. You need Dexterity for this. But also it requires Master Combat Training. Okay. Okay. How much do I need? All right, so I think I'm only going to get it up to, like, at least 26 decks, and then I'll stop with Alistair, because I definitely want to get Shield Mastery. I've never used Alistair without a shield. Oh, it's defense. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Try that again. Yeah, I guess we'll try that for now. Okay, let's go. All right, so off to the Tower of Ishal, where we are going to go ahead, light the beacon for Terran Logain's char uh, forces to go ahead and charge from cover. But Q, Battle of the Helms Deep, like <laughs> cutscene. almost like the creepy the fog rolls in here they come Get to the tower of his shop. Yep. Good thinking. All right. So tell you what, friends, we're gonna go. Oh, there, there, there. oh my God! <laughs> there, there. Oh my God! There, there. Shit! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> All right. Well, that's what I get. All right. Let's go. Wardens, aren't you? The tower, it's been taken. What are you talking about, man? Taken how? The Darkspawn came up through the lower chambers. They're everywhere. Most of our men are dead. Then we have to get to the beacon and light it ourselves. Great. Uh. 
All right. Well, I thought for some reason that we would have that guy as our ally, but no, we have the mage. I'm actually happy about that. Uh, I don't think there's anything down here to... Yeah, I don't think there's anything down here to get. So, I'll tell you what, we're going to try to go ahead and make our way to the tower then. We're just going to beeline it that way. And I appreciate the flaming weapons. being attacked like by somebody else too by my health went down so 38 from the mage I think I might need to invest in stealth I mean, otherwise, I don't know how I'm supposed to, like, play as my main character and actually get close enough for flanking attacks and whatnot. Like, yeah. Yeah. I still need to figure out, like, what the... Ah, damn. The inventory's full. Uh, I gotta figure out what I can flank, or, like, what the flanking... Like, uh, where I need to stand positioning-wise? Because uh, I know... I picked up that passive, but I just don't know exactly, like, where the hell do I need to stand in order to have it be flanked? I guess... Oh, there's that guy. No, 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 no. Thank you, Alistair. Alright, that wasn't bad, but after I dealt uh, enough damage... Ah, shit. I've had so much crap in my inventory. Uh, after I dealt enough damage that finally that alpha was going to turn it around. Oh. I know why I got all this crap. Alright, all this stuff that's in my... Ooh, shit. I put the enchanters boots in there. I shouldn't do that. Um, all the stuff that's in my inventory is just because of, from Sir Jory and uh, Davith. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to Yeah, remove from junk. There we go. Alright, well, uh, just bear with me. I'm going to have to destroy everything. There we go. Fruit extract. Okay. All right, friends. <clears throat> Tell you what, this is actually where I'm going to end this part of the episode. Next episode, we are going to tackle all of the Tower of Ishal and uh, go ahead and light that beacon so Terran Logain's forces can charge in against the Darkspawn. So I will just see you in the next episode.